How to Teach Numeracy to Indigenous Students. This presentation aims to take you through a quick review on the issue of teaching numeracy to Indigenous students, drawn from the text Teaching and Learning in Aboriginal Education by Neil Harrison and supporting references as mentioned. An overview. Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander students frequently experience mathematics in their daily lives. Though unaware, students develop understanding through games and unstructured and informal experiences. The key to engaging students in mathematics is to create experiences that replicate authentic experiences that are relevant, purposeful and connected to the lives of Aboriginal children. The role of the teacher is to reconcile the differences students face between the informal and formal, unstructured learning environments and structured environments. Many schools employ highly educated and highly respected Aboriginal educators. These experts often are highly skilled teachers of mathematics. These people have access to local knowledge not obtainable by outsiders to the community. A collegial classroom approach to teaching with Aboriginal educators are the keys to success in effectively teaching mathematics with Indigenous students. Mathematics before starting school. Aboriginal students encounter shape, objects, number and measurement in their daily play and games. Parents and family members introduce these concepts at a very young age, whether intentionally or unintentionally. Indigenous children can be observed from a young age engaging with their toys or natural elements, grouping, sorting and creating patterns just for fun. It has been found that many Indigenous children have an innate skill for subitizing and position. By encouraging play-based mathematical understandings at a young age, students are able to further develop these natural strengths and gifts. Outside of school. Students encounter mathematics outside of school in sport, games, fishing, tools, music, art, artefacts and dance. These aspects of Indigenous life are viewed by students as more important than structured learning activities within the school, where no relevance is drawn to their daily life experiences. Teachers are required to create connectedness and relevance in each activity to students' interests and integrate learnings through explicit links to cultural context. Through scaffolding mathematics, tension between school and home time can be eased. The spatial relationship of symbols in artwork can create authentic Indigenous mathematical experiences. If Indigenous people believe that paintings are the literature of the Aboriginal people, what ways can we involve mathematics? Teaching and learning mathematics in school. While it is imperative to follow the guidelines of the national curriculum in the areas of number and algebra, statistics and probability, and geometry and measurement, Aboriginal children's learning involves more than these mathematical concepts. Students need to develop learning habits and understandings of working mathematically. Indigenous students require learning experience that promote processes of mathematics and critical thinking. Powerful mathematical thinking is propelled by more than concepts, facts and rote learning. In order to close the gap in Indigenous education, students must understand the following three concepts. Mathematization, the process of generating problems. Argumentation, justifying thinking and understanding to other people. Connection, creating links to other subject areas and to a real world context. Explicit teaching and feedback. Teachers need to adopt an explicit teaching approach when teaching mathematical vocabulary, standard algorithms and arithmetic facts. To enhance the learning of mathematics for Aboriginal children, it is important to give them meaningful feedback on their developed mathematical ideas. Feedback should be explicit about what and how the child needs to learn in order to improve, as well as giving both strengths and weaknesses of their mathematical processes and personal understandings. Engagement. Children learn more effectively when they are directly engaged in their learning of mathematics. Engagement can be enforced by teacher's initiative, approach to go into the community, 
and learn about the mathematical resources and materials that they can use to base their teaching with real life experiences. Community engagement attracts the involvement of parents and community members to build up on the mathematics being taught at, at school through activities at home. Assessment. Mathematics learning is assessed so that teachers and children know what is known, how it is known, and how this knowledge can be used to plan the next learning experience. Remember to incorporate a variety of assessment strategies to identify the mathematics knowledge and needs of Aboriginal children. Assess their learning through written, oral and visual approaches that are mathematically and culturally appropriate. Conclusion Aboriginal children have a strong sense of belongings to their family, the area in which they live, and the place from where they come. Therefore, the key to successful achievement in Aboriginal students' mathematics is the need to feel valued and respected in the mathematics that they do.